Hey guys, welcome back to episode 11 of my Minecraft. <clears throat> Today, as I told you guys in the last episode, I'm taking... Looks like we have something growing over there, but taking an extra sword just in case I get lost or something. I already have a headache. <laughs> So, be patient. We got a beat. Be patient with me. Um, if I'm not, if this is not as long as it usually would be, or anything like that, because I'm just, I've got my blood pressure through the roof to the point where my mom's like, we need to take you to urgent care. But at this point, I feel like I'm okay. Huh. To, you know, I, I don't feel like I need to go to urgent care. I have a doctor's appointment coming up on the 7th of February. Where I will address all this stuff with her. Jack almost knocked the TV over today. If you don't know, Jack is one of our two cats. And he almost knocked over our TV. Right, Nick? Yep. Nick's here, but he's he's doing a... Um, I'm trying to work on our intro for our channel. Yeah. This is going to look really cool once it's done. We want, I mean, it took us a little bit of a minute to figure out what we wanted to do. Because we wanted something that's similar to one vlog away's intro, which is the echocardiogram with um with the heart. With the heart and the name in it. <clears throat> but obviously I wanted it a little bit gamified since this is a gaming channel. Let's get this on me. Um But yeah, that's what we're doing right now. We had a nice dinner. Uh, what else exciting has happened today? Anything? Nick slept a lot. We got to take a nice little nap together earlier. Which is good, because when, so, when I work third shift, I don't always get to, to, have, to, to take a nap with her, so that's, that's pretty. Only on my days off do I really get to. That's the one thing that I kind of do miss about somebody that works day shift. And I could work day shift and eventually uh, switch over I really, if it ever turned up. But right now, that seems to be like the best, the most stable thing for us right now. But if there's ever a time when I could switch over, like if I if I got a better job somewhere and it was day shift, I would take it. Sure. What do, you, what do you think, babe? I'm drowning. Like, literally or metaphorically? No, I'm... Hang on, babe. The people on the screen know I... what I'm going through right now, but he doesn't know because he's trying to do the... Look, look, check it out, look. Ah, there we go. Oh, wow, he's really, really getting through it, like, quickly. I'm so proud of him. He's so much smarter than me. No. He's smarter in a different way than I am, I'm so... Kind of. You know, like, it's, it's like, growing up, I was always compared, like, I was, <gasps> was always compared to Is that Lapis? People. Yeah, that's Lapis. Okay. I was always compared to other people. Like, some people would say, like, I was inferior to other people, and sometimes even, like, mentally handicapped. And other people would say how brilliant I was. And it's tough when you're, like, keep, keep getting flip flop back and forth with people, too. And, but I found out overall is that, you know, it's not that you're better or worse. It's just like apples and oranges, you know. Yeah, people try to shove everybody in this box of this is what... And I went through it a lot, like when Little Guy was first born, too. Or not when he was first born. But when he was like an infant. Well, why is he not doing X, Y, Z, you know, in the same at the same pace as child A and B? You know what I'm saying? Like, why is he not... Walking. 
by the time he's a year old like every other kid's doing? Why is he not? Clearly he has something wrong with him. You know what I'm saying, Nick? Yeah. But I don't feel like you can put everybody into this perfect little box wow. of, well, this is what's normal. Why is he not normal, you yeah. know? And there's, there's going to be times where you do better at somebody than something, and other times where where you're going to be better than someone else at something, you know? And, and, and everyone has and is going to have their own unique, you know, abilities or strengths and weaknesses, and that's just how life is, and that doesn't mean you're bad. Or The only thing I think determines that, you know, is, is your attitude, your ability to work hard, uh, make the best out of the situation that you have, even if it's a bad situation, make the best out of it that you can. That's what matters. Right. Most. But, and, um, you know, it was kind of like, um, sorry, go ahead. I mean, but, okay. Yeah, constantly comparing yourself to other people, it's not going to be good for you or for them, really. And, you know, it's like, um, some of you may not be on our, on our, um, on our, um, main, well, I call it our main channel because it's the channel we started with, but, um, our more generic channel where we put a lot of our challenge videos and our vlogs and stuff, which is linked in the bottom bar if you want to check it out. Um, but... You know, a lot of you may not have come from there. You might just be here for the gameplay, and, you know, you don't know, but it was like when the um, little guy was getting bullied in school, and me and Nick and Mom were in the freaking office every week trying to figure out. But the thing that I found very um, concerning, maybe to a point, I guess, would be it was constantly, he needs to change. He's doing something wrong. To make people treat him this way. And he needs to change. And I even asked the principal at one point. I'm like. When does it not become about him doing something wrong? Yeah. When does it become about. Hey you know these kids are picking on a kid for no reason. Just because he's different. And eventually. Even the teacher sided with, with the kids. With the kids too. And not with the Right. With the little guy. That's okay. You know, and it's like when everybody's against you, of course you're going to act out, and of course you're going to... Because, you know, people don't give little kids enough credit, I don't feel like. Yeah. You know, he knows what's going on. Should I go with purple for the heart like this? Or should I go with red? Oh, no, I like that. You like that one? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, guys. We're doing creative. Creative stuff right now. I appreciate the fact that Nick tries to keep me involved and stuff. Yeah. It's, it's us together. It's our I'm proud of what we've accomplished so far. Uh, we haven't really done much on the Let's Play yet. We're, we're getting videos. We're backlog drilling. We're backlogging right now. But I'm proud of what we've done on the vlog channel and what we've accomplished together. And, and it's such a good job. And just like I said, like we said before, it was my dream a long time ago to have this. But now that she's been so supportive of me and everything. But and now, now it's her dream, part of her dream too. It's our dream together now. This is our baby together. This is our thing that we're doing together, and I'm so proud of us. How, how do you feel, Bebe? Well, um, you know, we have 120 subscribers now on our main channel. Over 13,000 views on the channel itself. I mean, we've come a long way. And, you know, a lot of it is thanks to just kind of timing on both our parts. Just being like, you know what, I think we should do a video about this, and why not? And just kind of going with it because it's something that we're passionate about. Yeah. Like him with the Heat Miser um, song or tribute thing to George S. Irving. And me with the, the Trisha Paytas videos. Yeah, videos, yeah. Done such a good job with all those. 
and it's it's a uh, it's it's really a hobby and sort of a passion for us. I mean, it's something like oh, I'm at work and I think, hey, this would be a good video idea for video, and I'm I'm always thinking about it. It's not just something that you do; it's something that that you live and breathe. It's part of who you are, you know. Yeah, he. The grandma fell on top of me. He's more of like the video ideas are more him, and then I kind of we kind of run with them as a couple. Like we'll kind of be like, yeah, I like that, but maybe we could do this. You know, like some of the videos are kind of like a hybrid of both of us working together towards this common goal of we want this to be successful. This is what I think. Okay, well I have a different view on it. This is what I think, and then we kind of go from there. Do you agree? I I agree. Yeah. You know, we don't always get along, and we're not always... I mean, we do pretty much always get along. That that was poor wording. And even if we don't, we, we usually resolve things fairly quickly. You'll see it in some of our Let's Plays. I was just playing some back today when I was uh, going through to just see, you know, what do we have, what do we need type thing. And I, I clicked on one of the videos, and I'm like, God, Nick! And I'm like, Because <laughs> he was trying to tell me that... He, the thing with Nick is... Hey. He's got, like, the biggest heart in the world and the best intentions. But sometimes they're just like, okay, do you not see that a zombie's eating my head right now? I'm not going to stop. Switch weapons. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> and he'll be like, you need to use a sword. You need to use a sword. You need, like, over and over. It's like, I understand. You know, it's just stuff like that. <laughs> But I feel like sometimes that's why we get along so well, too. Yeah. Oh, shoot. What happened? I put redstone on there, not knowing that... It sets it off. Yeah. Good job, man. Oh, well, that was a mistake. Not you, me. But this is sort of a preview of what it will look like after it's done. Oh, uh, shit. I made the mistake of putting the reds down. But I, I made just, the mistake of opening a wall that had water, and now my whole thing's filling with water. Run! Alright, guys, so we're right at 15 minutes. My headache is going absolutely insane because of the uh, blood pressure problem. I'm hoping once I get the blood pressure stuff figured out, Everything else is just going to kind of fall into place for me. But it is no bueno. I might actually end up with the urgent care tomorrow. I'm not sure. <sighs> and then Wednesday, I go to the DMV to make steps towards independence for everyone. Well, for me and Nick and Connor. I'm just hoping that I can do what I need to do. I believe in you, baby. I know you can do it. But, anyway, guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe, we would absolutely love that, right? Yep. Yes, please subscribe. It really does help out a lot. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Bye, everybody. Yeah, so this is what...